There's a lot of stuff in there, but everything's negotiable. Okay, maybe it's not for sale, maybe it is. Hey, what is the 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 thing here? How's it going, man? Good, good. How much? How much are they? Which one? I mean, any. Uh, I mean, I don't... well, I'm trying to get get rid of these for 15 each. Yeah. I mean, if you if you're gonna buy me more than what it is, I got quite a bit of them. Ten dollars each. And those. Just trying to get rid of. I had them too long. So. Everything's in here to them. Huh? Everything's in here to them. Yeah, everything is in there. This one here. And then, I mean, if you check and see the price, yeah. yeah. I mean, you know. Just make sure you open this one up here. Yeah, this one looks like it might have a little bit less yeah. though. Make sure. Yeah, this one don't have, this one doesn't have. Yeah. Yeah, no, they, they don't, yeah, let me take this one out. This one is complete. But let me see something because I also have some boxes. Yeah, more of them? Yeah. Yeah. What is it? How many are you looking to get? It just depends on what you got and what you want for them. You know the prices on it. Mm -hmm. I mean, I'm trying to get rid of most of this mm -hmm. stuff out the way. Yeah. I mean, if you buy me, if you buy these fifteen dollars each, I give you these for ten. I mean, okay. you into plumbing or something? I have a buddy that's a plumber, but okay. then I kind of buy and sell stuff sometimes too. Okay. So it just depends on. And if you see, if you look at Home Depot stuff, yeah, they're all plastic. Garbage. Yeah. All this here are all metal and they're all good. So, and I got quite a bit of them, so if, if you're looking at to get quite a bit of them. You got more of these new or not? Yeah, I got I got another that's one box. These. That's three in there. Right? Oh there's three three of those in there. Ah. So there's three of yes. the three of these in here. That's correct. Alright. And the faucets, I got about 36 of them. 36 of these? Yeah. <laughs> and how many total of these? I got, well, right now I only got those six. These six. Or seven. And then all those? I got, I got 36 of these. That's this one right here. Yeah. I just took it out so everybody can see what it is. So 36 of these and then six of those. How many you, how many you want to buy? <laughs> I'll buy all of them if the price is right. No. What'd you do for everything? Let me see. Um, let me see what we got here. Uh, yep. Make sure I got 36 here. Tell you what. Give me 500. I'll give you all 16 in those. All what? All 16. Oh, so, you only got 16 of them? I mean, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. 36? 32. 32, 32 of them? Yeah. <laughs> so 32 of these and then... And those. Matter of fact... About 400. It's a little over $10 a piece. Kill them in that bag. You know that. You know better than I do. Hey, I, I, I understand. I got to sell through all of them though. Yeah. 450. And they're all new like that? You have them in there? I got them in cases right cases there. Cases in there. Can you throw these in? Yeah. All right, let's you, do it. You, you're making me kill it. Let's do it. Hey, you're helping me out. I'm trying to get all this shit out of here. Yeah. At one point in time, I had 10 cases. Oh, yeah. yeah. Sell it to a bunch of them? Yeah, I went to the bar, man. Put them out here. Two cases coming by. All right, all right. But then after a year, I'm like, you know what, man? I'm getting all this out of here. Further come by. Yeah. 
Yeah. Take this one here too, man. All right, appreciate it. All right. So, you interested in a jacket too? Nah, I don't get cold enough here for that, no, really. Man. <laughs> 20, 40, 60, 81, 20, 40, 60, 82, 20, 40, 60, 84, 20, 40, 60, you count it again. You have tags? I might have a t I might I have, have no tails. Yeah. There you go. I appreciate you. Alright. Alright man, I appreciate it. I appreciate you, Walt. Yep. Be safe, man. You too, man. So in the video you just seen, you see me buy a bunch of faucets. Like bathroom faucets. Now, these are one of my favorite things to buy. Not because it's the most interesting thing, but listing wise and eBay wise. I just, if you want to build an eBay store, I love buying stuff like that. And this is the reason. So all these were the same. So you just put a quantity on, store them. They take time to sell, but they will sell. So quick numbers real quick. So there was 42 total. I'm listing them all for $59.99 a piece. That total is $25.19.58. Now what people don't tell you is you got shipping and you got eBay fees. eBay fees is about 12%. That leaves 22, 17, 23. And then I figured about $12 a piece to ship, that's 504. So the total left profit is about $1,713 after you sell through all of them. And that comes out about 40, $41 a piece. So yeah, they take a, they'll take a while to sell through all of them, but it's very easy. Two eBay listings, quantity, store them, just grab one, put it in the box, ship it. Can I show to the, um, my jeweler that if there's no black, um, I can pay you and then there's no black carbon in there. The what? The black carbon in the, this one, there's that, this one. This one? Mm-hmm. So uh, you want to pay and then take it over there and then? Yeah. That's fine with me, I don't care. Huh? I don't care. Yeah, if he says there's a black carbon, then I'm not gonna buy it. What is that? A what? <laughs> <laughs> we believe that's uh, bad luck. Oh, like bad luck? Yeah. Oh yeah. I mean, if you pay and then you take it to him, as long as it's within like a day or two, huh? I don't care. All right. Can I'll I be come here. tomorrow? Yeah, I'll be here. Okay. All right. Because by then I'll be done my cooking and everything. All right. I, just, I was just passing by from here. All right. And I had to. I guess I don't have a CO2 in it. Uh, I have a monk left that to me, so I don't know if there's one in it or not. Yeah. The only problem with them sometimes is sometimes the seals go bad in them, but gasket or whatever they are. I haven't ever taken it out of the box. He left it to me when he passed away. It's never been out of the box. Yeah. Yeah, there's no CO2 in it. Oh, okay. Mm -hmm. It's pretty clean though. Oh yeah, like I said, it's never been out of the box since he left it to me. What is that? It must have been a little cleaning pad yeah, he had in it. A little oil rag or something? Yeah. I know I called the Daisy Museum a couple of years ago. Spoke with, spoke with one of the curators there. And I, I gave her the serial number over the phone and she looked it up. She said it was manufactured in 1988. Now two years ago I said, well what do you think it would be worth if I could sell it? She said, well, at this time, maybe between 50 and and $100. That was a couple yeah. of years ago, but that depends on how much you would get. Yeah, you can buy them new. You can buy them like in that condition online for around 80 and then, but they have fees and stuff when you sell them, so right. 
Yeah. What's like the most you could give me for it? Would you do 40 on it? Could you do 45? I used to have one almost exactly like this when I was a kid. Cock it right there. Mm -hmm. I don't have a thing in it. Yeah, I'll do 45 on it. All right, how long would I have to come back to the one and get it? Oh, so you want to pawn it? You don't want to sell it? Yeah, I just, I just, well, I'm never going to use it, so I don't know if it would be anything, any value to it. And years ahead, I have no idea. Probably it would have not. to be a long time because be I mean, you got to think it's already 35 years old, and it's worth you know around 80 bucks. So another, I just sell it to you for 45. Yeah, there are there are a lot more valuable ones, but there are the older ones and stuff in like the 50s and stuff like that. But, I take 45. Yeah. All right, you have an idea with you? Yes, I do. You have any other stuff like that? Do you? Was that the kind of it of it? Huh? That was kind of all they left you, like those, like guns wise. That well, was... I had a, I had a uh, original Colt six shot pistol. I had that. Now that was the original Colt. He bought it back in the '60s. Mm -hmm. And then I had a, a little 410 single shot shotgun. I had a, uh, a 38 special. I had a double barrel shotgun and, uh, and a pump. I think it was a 12 gauge. Did you end up selling all that stuff? Yeah, I found a guy. He, uh, cause I didn't want, really want any of the guns in my house. And, uh, he came over and looked at everything. And, uh, the Colt was the one that brought the most money, the pistol. Yeah. Cause it was an original Colt. Yeah, depending on condition wise. Well, it was in excellent thing. condition. You ain't gonna believe this, but he gave me two thousand dollars for that pistol. Yeah, they can be up there depending on what they are. They can be up there, especially any of the old, like snake guns, like pythons, anacondas, stuff like that. They can right. They can be expensive. I think mine was a different model, but almost the exact same gun when I was a kid. Almost right. the exact same. One. I think they make a couple different models of that one. And then I had a, I had a bolt action, 22 rifle. You would put the shells in the, under the barrel. Yeah. And feed They're it like that. Yeah. yeah. Sign right there, right thumbprint right there. You don't have to press that too hard. You sign on the top. Yes, sir. So you got 20, 40, 45. All right. This one's mine, that one's yours, and you're good to go. I appreciate it. All right, well, I appreciate yeah, it. All right, thank you. So you see the guy brought in a old Daisy BB gun. I used to have one. I think they made a couple different models of these, but I had one exactly like this when I was a kid. But it's in really good condition. And, I mean, even though it's 30-something years old, I mean, they don't sell for that much, really. These are them right here. These took offers, 69, 80, 99, and those are all offers, so they went for less than that. But it's clean and nice, and I, I love stuff like this for the shop just because it's a little different. It's super clean. I'll put like 80 bucks on it, and I probably should be able to get it in the shop. Maybe put 80 on it. Somebody offered me 70, 75, but I like it. There's a lot of stuff in there, but everything's negotiable. Okay, maybe it's not for sale, maybe it is. Hey, what is the the, the thing here? The little license plate. Huh? The little license plate thing. Well, a lot of people would. How do you, but how do you pause? There's a screw under there. You'd have to cut a pit in the corner off Oh, just there. take this one off? 
No, I won't take that down because the whole thing will oh, come down. Yeah. So if you want to take a saw and cut that and you can the get it quarter. off. If you want to get it, you could get that for two dollars. But you gotta take how to it get, off. Uh, do you have huh? a, do you have a saw? I don't have a saw. Do you uh, have anything that I could like I saw I I sold the saw yesterday. I don't know if you have any luck with that. Yeah, I don't, I don't know. Uh, the kitchen table set. The kitchen table, though. Not I, sure. That goes without. That table is here. Just... got a couple of these old license plates there's like four of them like I don't know like four of those this little thing I don't know I saw this little box sitting over there it's just got old miscellaneous pins I guess like oh yeah I don't, I don't know what it is like old, oh I old don't pins really and... want to get rid of them right now oh, okay all right that's fine no nope. in two boxes of the stuff you said two dollars and this little metal whatever that is little scale thing well it's old metal <laughs> and, four, and four license plates 15. That's fine. The whole bunch. That'll do it. I'll take a look inside too. I'm gonna just run. I'll throw this in my truck. And then, I think. Honestly, I'll just. I'm gonna put this in my truck and then I'm gonna come fine. back and look inside and see if I see anything in there. Go ahead and pay you and get out of your hair right now. Do you have a five on you? Oh yeah. All right. They said you're 85. Did you say you're 85 years old? Yeah, I'll be 86 before the year's over. Wow, nice. Yeah. Great. Alrighty. I'm going to go throw this in the truck and I'll come back and take a look Fine. at whatever you have inside. Oh, that's... Like a take Halloween, it down. Halloween stuff. My daughter, that's what my daughter is looking for. I like these old license plate things. Give Ike a Republican Congress, 1930 Massachusetts, 48, and then a state police from 72. Um, a bunch of these old pins. Pins sell good, some of them. And then just some drill bits for the shop and this old scale probably isn't worth much i'm thinking you know i've seen it like 40 50 bucks maybe i don't know if that sometimes we'll just sell them in the shop if they don't go for much but these old license plates i don't know if any of them are worth anything but uh don't don't sleep on those some some of these things can be really good so the last thing we have to get to is the giveaway so we're getting down to the end of what we have left so i got these four to give away this week that's for the video you're watching now. And then, like I said, we're going to give one of these away every week in the following videos. And then 
these are all the winners from the previous couple weeks sorry had a long week went on vacation didn't get them out but the other thing is too there was somebody in there from canada i went ahead and sent it but i think cost me almost twenty dollars to ship so that that you know those coins right there i got over four hundred dollars and give them away so you know if you're out if you're in another country and you win i'm just going to ask you to pay for the shipping because you know some of that shipping can be expensive if it's got to go to other places and then also too getting comments about more videos more videos when i started the channel i said i was only going to put quality and the best videos i could out so we're going to go to wednesdays too i'm going to do a video two times a week wednesday at five and friday at five so after this video, the following Wednesday, be on the lookout for that video. But anyways, we got 473 likes for this week. So we're going four winners. Got a link to the video. Number of comments, I think there was over 200, 268. So we're going four winners. First winner is Cyberwolf. Next winner, Rich Poly 3. Number 3, Richard Perez. I wonder if that's Richie. My shoe guy. And then Haley G. Mike, that's Mike. Mike from Roll Street, Bennett Street. Oh, is it? Yeah. That's one of my old childhood friends. Congratulations, Mike. But anyways, so the winners hit me up right here on Instagram. That's the easiest way to get a hold of me. A few people told me they win, but they didn't verify their account, so I'm not sending it to you unless you verify your account. I got those four left. Did I forget anything? I don't think so. Sounds okay. good. Well, once again, we appreciate y'all. Be on the lookout for that Wednesday video.